balancing chemical reaction. Okay, so this is Al plus O2 uh, gives you Al2O3. So this is aluminum plus oxygen gives you aluminum oxide. Okay, so when you're balancing equations, it's like solving equation in math, similar to that. So here on the left hand side, you got two, sorry, you got one atom of aluminum and here you got two atoms. So here the aluminum is not balanced. So the first step, I'm going to multiply this by two. So this is two Al plus O2 is equal to Al2O3. Okay, so yeah, you've got two aluminiums, here you've got two aluminiums. So this is not balanced. This is also not balanced. Uh, aluminum is balanced, but here you've got two oxygens, and here you've got three oxygens. So now I, well, how can I make this two oxygen into three oxygens? Well, what if I multiply this by 1.5, because I know 1.5 times two is equal to three. I want to make this, so basically you have to multiply this and this number. So well, I'm going to multiply this by 1.2, so this is 2Al plus 1.5O2. So you multiply this number and this number. So this is 3 oxygen is equal to Al2O3. Now this seems to be balanced, but this is not good enough. This is O, this is not zero, so this is oxygen, O. You can't have one and a half oxygen atom or molecule. Here you have to have a neat number. So well, I'm going to double this. So you can't double one of them. I'm going to multiply the whole thing by two. So what basically I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply this whole thing by two. So to also multiply this whole thing by two. So as you learned in uh, solving equations. So this becomes 4Al plus 3O2 gives you 2Al2 O3. So let's check our answer whether it's balanced. So here you got 4 oxygen here, sorry 4 aluminium and here you got 4 aluminium. 2 times 2 is 4, that's how you multiply. So let me use for oxygen a different color. So the, here you got 3 times 2 is 6 oxygen, and here you got 2 times 3 is 6. So it is balanced. So this is how you balance an equation. Okay, let's move on to the next one. C2H4 plus O2 is e gives you carbon dioxide, CO2 plus H2O. So <coughs> First look at carbon, so you got two carbon atoms here, and here you got only one carbon. So let's first balance the carbon, so this is C2H4 plus O2 gives you two CO2 plus H2O. I'll do one step at a time. So here carbon, you got two carbon on the left and two carbon so two carbon on the right and two carbon on the left. Now let's look at hydrogen. So here you got four hydrogen here and you got two hydrogen here. So if I put a two here, that will be balanced. So let me write the whole thing. C2H4 plus O2 gives you two CO2 plus two H2O. So your carbon is balanced. You can see two carbon, two carbon, four hydrogen, four hydrogen. Now let's look at oxygen. Here you've got two times two is four, plus two is, this is four oxygen. So this is, here you can say this is four oxygen, and here you've got two oxygen. So you've got six oxygen here. So you have to make this. Uh, 6, so what can I do? So I'm going to multiply this by 3. So C2H4 plus 3O2 gives you 2CO2 
uh, plus 2 H2O. Does this make sense? So two carbons. So let me under, use a different color. We've got two carbons here. We've got two carbons here. What about hydrogen? You've got four hydrogen here. You've got two times two is four hydrogen here. What about oxygen? You've got six here. And here you've got four. Two times two is four. Plus two is six. So this is balanced. Okay, one more. So how do you balance this? So you've got CH4 plus Cl2 is equal to CCl4 plus HCl. So here, again you've got carbon here and carbon here, so it's already balanced. Let's look at hydrogen here. You've got four hydrogen here, and you've got only one hydrogen here. So let's balance the hydrogen. So this is CH4 plus Cl2 gives you CCl4, CCl4 plus 4 HCl. So 4 HCl, sorry, HCl. So let's now look whether we have balanced. We've got one carbon here, you've got one carbon here. What about hydrogen? You've got four hydrogen here. You've got four hydrogen here. This is only hydrogen. So this now chlorine. You've got two year and four year. So I'm just going to put two year. So if you put two year, so this is already balanced. You've got four year and you've got four chlorine here. Okay, so let's move on to this one. Okay, so what does it say? C2H6O plus O2 is equal to CO2 plus H2O. So this is something that I want you to do yourself. Okay, so look at carbon. Balance oxygen the last. Okay, because oxygen is alone. So first balance carbon, then hydrogen, and then oxygen. Okay, same way here. First, we can balance uh, silicon, this is SI, and then you can do oxygen, then you, can, you have got hydrogen, and then you've got fluoride. So this is something that you can do for practice. 